On December 19, 2016, a 911 call was made to report a murder. The murdered woman's young son had found her dead and then reported it to a neighbor, who phoned police, which you will hear soon. Tara O'Shea Watson was choked and then stabbed to death by her estranged husband, Jeremiah Manel, and her body was left for her 12-year-old son to find. I want to raise emergency. Uh, yes, it is. State, state Trooper over here at uh, 7901 Henry Street. Okay, is it Henry Street, you said? Is that in Commercial Township? Uh, yes. Okay, what's going on there? Uh, yeah, I, I, uh, my, my wife's best friend's door, uh, son just came down to my house, yeah. talking about his mom's dead. Yeah, okay. Just woke me and my wife up to have a sound sleep. My wife, is, my wife is inside right now, checking on her to see if she's okay. Okay, 7901 Henry Street, you said what's going on exactly? Uh, my wife's best friend's son, Ted, uh, Best friend, her son, just came down to my house saying his mother is dead. Is dead? Yes. Okay, and is she, are you there? Can you see if she's breathing? Uh, my wife is inside right now. I'm walking through. I'm not touching anything just in case. All right. Do you know how old she is? How old is she? She is dead. Okay, but do you know how old she was? Uh, how old is she, hun? I know she's in her 30s. Yeah. And what's your name, sir? Yeah. Okay. And 35 is her age. 35, and they just found yeah. her? Yeah, my wife just found her on the living room floor. Okay. All right. Hold her ex husband her ex husband was over here last night doing brake line work on her truck. Okay. And injuries to her that you can see, or is she just. Oh, uh, hi. Is there any injuries can you see? I'm not, I don't want to touch her. My, my, my wife doesn't want to touch her. Okay, she's but, covered up in a blanket. Okay, so it looks like she may have passed in her sleep? Yeah. yeah. Okay, but there's no, like, any injuries to her, no blood anywhere, right? Uh, I don't see any blood. Okay. And, okay. And her, ex, and, her, and her ex-husband was here last night, and I got a paramedic here. Uh, off Oh my God, she was murdered. It was a she, murder? What kind of injuries? I'm going to say with state police right now. Okay, what kind of injuries does she have, sir? Uh, All right, sir, hold on one I second. I need state trooper out here now. All right, calm down. I'm going to connect this to state police right now. Okay? Hey, uh, hold on one second. State Police, Cumberland County, with a he's at 7901 Henry Street. Uh, he says that he just found a 35-year-old female in bed. Uh, it appears that she was murdered in her sleep. Uh, Sorry, that's 7901 Henry Street, right? Yes, ma'am. And what's your first I'm name? I'm and who is this female? This is a friend of my friend. Uh, uh, friend of my and she was staying there overnight? This was her home. Her home? Okay. Her home, yes. Following police involvement, Jeremiah went on the run but was captured quickly. After a full investigation, Jeremiah Manel was charged with first-degree murder. On March 15, 2019, he was sentenced to life in prison without parole. On February 25, 2020, Sarah Boone called 911 to report her husband, 42-year-old Jorge Torres Jr., dead. She gives a bizarre account of a hide-and-seek game gone wrong, where her husband hid inside a suitcase, where he would ultimately, suffocate. Jorge had previously been arrested several times, for alleged domestic violence against Boone. Boone herself was also arrested once, for alleged battery against Jorge. 911, what is the location of your emergency? 4748 France Court, apartment 3. 4748, what's the street name? France, F-R-A-N-T-Z. And the apartment number? 3. Is this a police or medical? My boyfriend is dead. Okay, send the line for the fire department. Do not hang up. Fire rescue. Location mercy. Desk 32. No, please don't leave. Four seven four eight 
France Lane, apartment three. France Court. France Court. Yes. Okay, is this near Mackenzie Drive? I don't know where that is. Okay, fine, okay. It's Hillwood Park Apartments. Okay, 4748 France, correct? Correct. All right, correct. Now tell me exactly what happened there. Uh, my boyfriend and I were playing last night, and mm -hmm. I put him in his case and we were playing. And okay. Like kind of hide-and-seek kind of thing. So I fell asleep, and I woke up, and he was dead in the suitcase. So I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. Right, okay, what's the apartment number? Three. Um, I don't know. Apartment three? Yes, like he has like blood coming out of his mouth, and I don't know if like he had like an aneurysm or like, what happened. Right, okay, all right, okay. Listen, we're getting help Purple. out there too. All right, okay. Okay, I. I now? Okay, 40, yeah, man, listen, we're on our way out there. You're at 407 716 Okay, is he hanging from somewhere or what, ma'am? No, I pulled him out of the suitcase. I tried the, giving him CPR. Out of the, okay. So he's, uh, he was in a suitcase? Yes, and I fell asleep. Okay, how old is the, how old is the boyfriend, ma'am? 42-year-old male. All right. Okay, we're, we're, sending, we're sending help out there. Share us the way out there? Yes, ma'am. I'm sorry? Yeah, okay. All right, listen to me. Okay, that, um, that just, that just need to confirm this. One. All right, I, I, understand. I just need to confirm this. Is he, is he awake at all? Is he conscious at all? No. He's purple. Is he, right, is he breathing? No. All right. I need you to get I need you to get him on the floor flat on his back for I me, did. okay? I did. I did. I tried giving him CPR. All right. I tried giving him CPR. Yeah, okay. Well, 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 we're, we're, nothing happened. He's purple. Right. Okay, listen to me. There's a defibrillator, but I need you to get it for me, okay? What is it? Do you have an AED, you have an AED available? No. All right. Are you right by him now? I'm sorry? You, are you right by him now? Yes. Okay, okay, lay him flat on his, okay, ma'am, ma'am, listen, uh, so listen, is he cold and stiff? Yes. Okay. Well, he's okay. not necessarily cold, but he's stiff. And right, he's okay. All right, he's listen purple. to me, I, uh, listen, listen to me, I want you to lay him flat on his back for me on I the did. floor. I did, I did. Removing the pillows, okay. Yes, I did. All right, okay. With, he's stiff and purple. Right, okay, listen, okay, man, that's fine, we're, we're still going to do compressions on him, okay? All right? Yes. Place the heel of your hand on his breastbone, right in the center of the chest, right between the nipples. Yes. Put your other hand on top of that hand. Betty, I'm telling you. Just by okay. looking at him, you can tell. Okay. Ah! And? Please! Okay, he just gurgled. Okay, okay. L listen to me. All right, I want to play. I want you to place the heel of your hand, uh -huh. okay, right between, the, right between his chest, right between his breastbones. Yes. Put your, other hand, put your other hand on top of that hand. Yes, oh, we want. We want to pump his chest to me hard and fast. One of those twice per second. I'm doing it again. Okay, no, no, just keep on pumping. That's all you need to do for me. Keep on pumping his chest for me. That's, I don't need you to stop and talk okay. or anything. I just want okay. you to count out loud for me, okay? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. This is... This is Nice. Okay, ma'am, just keep on pumping his chest. That's all you need to do for me, okay? Yes. Come on, please. Hurry up. Okay, ma'am, ma'am, they're driving here as fast as they can. Okay, don't stop to say hurry up. Just keep on pumping and counting. I'm, I'm still doing it while I'm pumping you, okay? Okay. Still doing it. All right, just keep, just continue pumping his chest. Count on a second count with you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32. Please hurry. Okay, man, they're getting there as fast as they can, okay? He's stiff and he's purple. Okay. Keep I'm pumping his chest for me, ma'am. I'm still doing it, okay? Still doing it. Just don't make right. me count. Okay. Right, okay, that's fine. Just you need a good job. Just keep on doing it for me. That's all right, they're getting there as fast as they can along with the sheriff's office also, okay? Please. Okay. 
Keep on pumping, man. One, we two, speak. three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Keep on pumping for me, ma'am. I'm, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Believe me, I'm doing it, okay? We are playing okay. Alright, I understand. Alright, just keep on pumping for me, okay? Okay. Please hurry. This right, is okay. Horrible. This is horrific. What happened? Like, what happened? Okay, man, just keep on pumping his chest for me, okay? They're they're in they're they're in the parking lot. They should be up there shortly, okay? I'm still doing it, okay? All right, okay, good. And you found him in a suitcase, you said? Yes. We were playing hide and seek last night. I fell asleep. I think they're here. All right, just keep on pumping his chest until they take over, okay? I am, I am. Okay. I am. Okay. I am. Okay. Open. Come in. Can I stop pumping now? Let, let them take over for you, okay? When was the last time anybody saw him? The last night. Okay. We were playing hide and seek. He hit a nerve. It's okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah, unfortunately, he's been down too long. There's nothing we can record him. Hello, ma'am. Yeah, so we're there, obviously. Uh, all right. Yeah, no, it's my boyfriend. Is your boyfriend? Okay. Does he have any kind of metaphors? No. No, not that I know. Hello? Hey, ma'am. The, the, the fire part's going to take care of you now, okay? Yeah, so we'll see you there. Alrighty. Oh, ma'am, is you still there? Hello? <laughs> Despite continuously claiming it was an accident, Sarah Boone was charged with first-degree murder. Following numerous appeals from her defense team, the trial has been postponed on several occasions. Her trial is set to begin in October 2024. The last 911 call comes from Cheryl Shepard, who frantically details how her son, Jovan Belcher, had shot his girlfriend, Cassandra Perkins. At around 7 a.m., Belcher, who was a linebacker for the Kansas City Chiefs, had had a verbal altercation with his partner, and mother of his child. After the argument became heated, Belcher withdrew a handgun, and fatally shot his girlfriend. In all, Cassandra was shot a total of nine times, including her neck, chest, abdomen, hip, back and leg. What's wrong with me? You did the right thing. on the way the whole time. How old is the patient? 22. A male or female? Female. And uh, is he breathing? 
She's so sweet in that bill. Please, Harvey. I don't okay. know how many times he shot her. They were arguing. <laughs> okay, so she's been shot? No. Okay, right now, is she awake? No, yes, stay with me. The ambulance is on the way. You hear me? You hear me? Cassandra! Hey! Stay with me! Okay, listen, ma'am. Is she awake? She's barely. She's just barely. Can she hear what you're saying? Yes, she's moving when I talk to her. Okay. Oh, God. Is she bleeding? Yes, she is. Where is she bleeding from? I can't tell in the back, it looks like. Okay, well, we don't want... Go ahead. Go ahead, Kitty. Where is your son at? Who up? Huh? Look, please. Just get this family up here, please. We're on the way. Where's your son at? Who up? He left? Yes. Okay. They were arguing and he yes. shot her? Yes, they was arguing. Okay, what's your son's name? Ma'am, the, the ambulance is on the way. What's your son's name? What kind of car did your son leave in? Or is he on foot? Sounds like she disconnected. She doesn't want to answer any questions. But she said her, her they were arguing and her son shot her. Okay. Yeah, I, I wanted to give her some bleeding controlling the, uh, advice also, but... Got the open line. Ma'am, are you there? Ma'am? Hello, ma'am? If you want to keep this open. Yeah. Medic 39, Chrysler, on a shooting, non-emergency stage for the police on a four. Medic 39, Chrysler, on a shooting, stage non-emergency stage for the police on a four. Number 39, make the call with Medic 39, Chrysler, non-emergency stage for the police on a shooting. A4, number 39, make the call with medic 39, Chrysler on a shooting, non-emergency stage for the police, respond A4. Medic 39 responding. Medic 39, so you're responding. Call for 39, and medic 39 responding, non-emergency. Affirmative. Meg 29, pump for 39, responding, not emergency, reported shooting, stage for police, scene not secure. Medic 39, we're staged. Medic 39, stage. Pump for 39, staging. Pump for 39, stage. Medic 39, pump for 39, PD reports on scene. Copy, pump for 39 on scene. Pump for 39 on scene. Dispatch, Medic 39. Medic 39 shows on scene. Medic 39 on scene. Medic 39. Pump for four, you're in service. Command terminated. Medic 39. Emergency with one and two firefighter. Uh, Medic 39, missed the destination. Copy transporting an emergency. Medic 39, could you repeat the destination? Center point. Medic 39, center point, emergency. Medic 39's at the hospital. I'll need extra time for cleanup, please. Medic 39 at the hospital, extra time cleanup. Hi there. Hello. Um, we need a code one ambulance. Oh, they think he's probably dead. Uh, number one Arrowhead Drive is a practice field at uh, Key Stadium. It's a self inflicted shooting. They said it's a done deal. Um, they've got a player that shot himself. The player? Yeah. Okay, what parking lot or whatever? Okay, but yeah, they well, they still need you um, to confirm it. I know, but what parking lot or whatever? Oh, it's say? the west side of the uh, stadium at the practice field. And you guys are there? Yeah. All right, we'll get over. We're on the way. We're on the way. Okay. At around 7.50 a.m., after committing the murder, Belcher left the home in his Bentley Continental, 
and drove five miles to Arrowhead Stadium, the Kansas Chiefs' practice facility. There, Belcher spoke to numerous staff members, and told them what he had done, including the Chiefs' owner, Clark Hunt. No one was able to calm Belcher down and at 8.01 a.m., police began to race to the scene. Hearing the approaching sirens, Belcher got out of his vehicle, knelt down, made a sign of the cross and then shot himself in the head, ending his life immediately.